Uh, I'm gonna show you how to fix the trouble that many AMD users, including me, having uh, dealing with. The once you upgrade to Windows 10, you you have this issue. All right, you upgrade to Windows 10, and there it is. For example, Counter Strike 1.6. I'm so used to playing the one. Uh, I mean, I'm so used to playing the 4-3 ratio, and it's not working. I mean, there are black bars on the on the left side and on the right side, and it's not great. I mean, it's not playable. Oh, uh, so I'm gonna show you how to fix this. All right. So the first thing you wanna do is go to your browser, put in Google this A H R C download and the first thing that appears you're gonna click on there it's a safe page don't worry about it um, wait it for load and you're gonna download this software well uh, what it does is that switch resolutions or expect ratios uh, with a hot key and I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna show you how to do that once you download this uh, Open it. I have it here on my uh, desktop right here. Open it, and if it doesn't show up, go right here, and you can see the icon below. Click on there, and then here, let me get a closer view of this. Sorry, I'm recording with my cell phone so you can see when I'm actually pressing the hotkey and how it's working. So, right here is a resolution you're playing, uh, for, for me, and in, in my case, I'm playing, I'm on this laptop, I use this resolution in general. So, there is a hotkey, I put F3, for example, right, so I don't mess with the Counter-Strike, uh, Vikings, uh, K-Binds, uh, my apologize, um, and right here below, there is a resolution you wanna, you wanna, Play uh, for example, Counter Strike 1.6. It works with CS:GO right here. Uh, it works with Day of Defeat, Dota 2, uh, many other several games that uh, you can play, and you have been having issues with. Um, so put this resolution. There is many resolutions you can use, but I'm gonna use this one. And the uh, the hotkey that I'm gonna use for this resolution is F4. So this program basically just switches between the the resolutions, right? So I'm gonna close this. Make sure your icon is there. Right here, should be here. I think it's not here. Oh, I closed it. All right. So it should be there. Open it again. Don't worry. Uh, the you don't have to set up again. All right. The hotkeys stay there. So I'm gonna open Counter Strike 1.6. Right. And there we go. There are the black bars. Right. See, there's my finger, so you can. See that there is a black bar on the, on the right side too. So what I'm gonna do is press, press F4. That is the hotkey that I use, hold on, that, that I use to switch to the 4.3 resolution, right? I'm gonna press it. And right now it's, it's all full, you know? So it's a pretty cool program, I, I didn't know about it. I had trouble with this. I had to go back to Windows 8.9 because that that, that is the way that I, uh, my my games were working properly. But I discovered this and I wanted to give it a try again to Windows 10 and it works. And the games doesn't doesn't shutter at all. I'm going to join a server right now. And I'm going to show you it doesn't shutter. There is no FPS issue. If you have a gaming computer, that's good for you. But for me, it works pretty nice. It, it works for CSGO. It works for G, uh, Gmod, Team Forces 2. It works for iRacing. Uh, that's a racing simulator I, I race on. Um, many other several games that can have issue with Windows 10. So, there is no, no nothing, nothing... Nothing bad on this uh, software, so you give it a try, guys. I'm gonna give you a download description below. I mean, the download link uh, on the description right below. And subscribe and like the video if you like it. Hopefully, this works for you. If it doesn't, just give me a comment and tell Anna uh, I can help you with. Thank you, guys.